next trigger while a US election will be the big global trigger. Here is some opinion from Manishi Re Chaudhary of BNP Paribas on what the GST bill could mean for sectors in India and the impact of the US election on emerging markets. We think that the consumer discretionary sector, tobacco in particular, um, would possibly turn out to be a gainer out of this entire GST announcement. We don't know at this stage which um, uh, manufactured goods or which commodities would be in which tax bracket. It seems that, uh, that even for those so-called demerit sectors like alcohol or tobacco, the total tax incidence might not be as bad as the market might have apprehended. Democrat government in the United States would be a continuation of what we have seen over the past eight years or so. You know, so that would not be so much of a concern as far as the market goes, because that's not really a big departure from the recent and medium term history. In the event of a Republican government, um, it could turn out to be a close parallel to Reaganomics, which essentially implies, um, you know, larger fiscal spending, possibly on infrastructure in the United States. It could also mean um, the U.S. dollar appreciating and uh, you know, possibly slightly more sharply than the market expects right now. And that eventuality could pose a risk for emerging markets because that um, you know, has never been good for flows into emerging market equities. So right, I'm now just a little bit of a very short break, but up next we'll get you a check on the queues to watch in the future.